Hello, Maddie from Hello Interloper here, finally back with gaming videos. Uh, unfortunately, it's not going to be a Blood Brothers video because I just found out today that there was an event going on, but it ended yesterday. So unfortunately, I'm a little late to the game here, don't have any material to go on. So we're having a little bit of a change of pace. Today, we're going to have a Defender of Texel video. And I am going to be pulling 1,042 Pixite builds, which is pretty much the equivalent of a copper coin in Blood Brothers. In other words, a lot of different fighters. <laughs> a lot. So it should be rather exciting. If you have no idea where I've been the past two months, I highly recommend, rather than asking, watching my general update where I've been video. It's only a minute and 21 seconds long and full of lots of puppies, so it will not inconvenience you in any way. It might actually be slightly entertaining. Anyway, Back to the subject at hand, if you have no idea what Defender of Texel is, or why I'm making a video about this, it's kind of a similar game to Blood Brothers, it's made by the same company, DNA, and it's pretty good. Um, so, if you want to know more about it, I actually have a video up called Alternatives to Blood Brothers, Defender of Texel, and with that you can find out how to start the game well, hopefully get... Um, a rare fighter, actually more than one rare fighter to begin with, so you kind of have a boost and an advantage over other new players, and how the game mechanics work and so on and so forth. So anyway, finally, the builds. Now before I go into that, I have many, many people asking me, how on earth do I play games on my computer? And I'll show you right now, it's really simple. Most of the time I actually do not play on the computer. Rather, I actually record what's going on with my jailbroken iPod, because I have a recording app on that, and then I just upload it and narrate it. Now, however, you can also play on your computer, and that's through a program called BlueStacks, and I'll just briefly show you what that's like. Um, BlueStacks, you got it at bluestacks.com, and you don't have to pre-order anything, don't listen to that. Uh, you just scroll down and you can download for Vista or you can download for Mac and actually it's XP Vista Win 7 or 8 or Mac or in general. So uh, it's basically an Android emulator and you can play just about any game although some games don't really fit correctly on the screen. There's a uh, program I believe it's called Gizmo Stacks that allows you to change the resolution of BlueStacks itself to possibly fit. Anyway, now to the real fun part. We are going to make a 1,042 Pixite builds. And by the way, all of this data, if you don't want to watch the video itself, will be in the description of this video. I'm going to be putting a link there to all my data tables, which will be updated regularly so uh, everyone can see them. Okay, so now it's time for the moment of truth. 1,042 Pixite builds. So yes, I am using BlueStacks, which is pretty awesome, and it seems to have crashed. That's lovely. Alright, kind of had some technical difficulties, so the first 100 pulls are uh, kind of briefly stated here. So I did manage to get a So Rush, which is pretty worthwhile. Um, got some not so great things, but you know what can you do? So. I'm going to scroll, see what other stuff I got here. Come on, you can scroll. Yeah, there we go. Slightly laggy because unfortunately uh, this takes a lot out of my computer. Did get some nice uncommons such as Mud Pup, and if I go down, I got a Nana. And then, of course, the legions of commons. Never too happy about getting those, but you know. You'll always get some with Pixite builds. So I'm going to slowly scroll down because I'm converting all of this into my uh, numerical data. So I have to see how many of each I have. And unfortunately things are a little bit cut off on the side. And it's actually because of blue stacks. And then a Koopy 39. That's a lot of fodder. So uh, yeah, Koopy's kind of like the uh, sanguine shade sort of thing. So anyway, let's build again, shall we? That's only one-tenth of all this. So, build a hundred. Let's go, go. Alright, let's hope we get a rare this time. And, oh yes, a rare. Eh, not a spectacular one, but I'll take it. 
And then here come all the uncommons. I'll just click away. And here we go. Okay, that's not that bad. Could be worse. So, got a lot of uncommons. Another mud pup, which is great because that's an edged fighter this time. And oh, two banunus, always useful. And actually, a lot less uncommons this time around. Seems like we got a lot more of these commons, which, of course, you know, they're useful. They're good trade fodder when you turn them into rares. You can get a few things out of them. I usually trade the rares for some uncommons that I need and then eventually fuse those together. And got 36 Sakupis this time. Let's build again! This is fun. Fun for me, because I get to get all this awesome stuff. But uh, I guess it's fun for you guys, too. Get to have a more accurate idea of what you get. Ah, there we go. Raid event guy, and uh, god, I hate that one. He's really not that great. He just has a lot of HP. Okay, no, I'm just gonna skip through here. I'm not really a fan of high HP. I'm more of a fan of high attack or high anything else but HP. <laughs> so anyway, that is a raid event character, and uh, it's pretty nice. Two rares. Um, let's see. Didn't get any spectacular uncommons this time. Eh, got a Banunu. Always a welcome sight. Now we just got a lot of commons. A lot, a lot of commons. Scrolling down, scrolling down, slowly. Because unfortunately it takes a while to scroll down with this, because if I do the roller on the, you know, like the middle button, scroll button on my mouse, it will go lightning fast and I can't actually convert this into numerical data. Let's build again! Alright, let's see what we get this time. Maybe an epic? Maybe. And sparkles? No sparkles! Aw, oh, no rares this time. That's unfortunate, but hey, got two last pull. Okay, so, uh, full mar. Eh, not the best uncommon. I mean, it sells for a lot because people just like him because he turns into a dragon as he attacks, but he's really not that great. Got some heart cloven, uh, Banunu, lots of commons, drowning in commons. I'm gonna have a lot of trading fodder. A lot. More than I'll know what to do with, but uh, maybe I'll buy myself a pavilion, I think it's called. Allows you to extend your inventory. 52 Akupis. That's a lot of Akupis. I'll be able to max out a lot of my dudes. Alright, so let's build another 100. Oh, I'd be so lucky if I got an Odin. Yes, I'm sure you all recognize Odin from Blood Brothers. Ah, oh, no sparkles? Really? You're not gonna give me sparkles? Oh, I got a good uncommon there. Alright, let's skip through this. We don't need to see the pretty colors. Anyway, Xenaries. He is pretty good. I can usually get a nice rare for him. And some other not so great uncommons. I always seem to get a heart cloven with every single pull. And uh, just skipping through. Oh, two Banunus this time. I will always welcome Banunu. <laughs> Alright, going through here. Uh, not so great. Don't really care because they're commons. But everything counts. Alright, 49 Akupis. Seems that my Akupi count has gone higher, but anyway, another build 100. Let's do this. Sparkles this time? Yes! Eh, not so great. Sparkles? Eh, definitely not good. Alright. I just saw another Heart Clove and I find that absolutely hilarious. Yeah, Sand Lily and Even Gloom, not so great. Um. We got another Zenries though. Always good. Do do do. Going through. And, uh, wow, I actually did not get a Heart Cloven this time. That's pretty surprising, seeing that I seem to attract Heart Clovens. What can I say? I'm a Centaur Magnet. <laughs> Alright, let's go through this and see how many Akupis. Ah, 40. Okay, it's going back down now. <laughs> I'm going to be drowning in Akupis at the end of this. All right. Surprisingly, I have not gotten a lot of raid-related guys. A little bit disappointing, but oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! I skipped too fast there. Let's take another look at that. 
Oh! Tavni Ishtar. That's good. And Manas. Manas. <laughs> I don't know how to say that. But yeah, that's an edged fighter. Also, I'm actually building up more Kohonors, or however the hell you say it. So, uh, always good to have one. But uh, apparently, Tavni Ishtar. What was it? Tishpak. Tishpak is the evolved version. It's actually really good in raids, uh, from what I've heard. So, uh, going through the uncommons. Do, do, do. Nothing that great. Ah, no more heart clovens, I guess. Uh, I've broken the spell of heart clovens. Going back through here, lots of commons that I don't need, and I'm gonna be going through my cachet or wagon or whatever you call it in this game forever. But, um, at least I'll get a koopies, right? Alright, so, this has been pretty lucky so far. I've added a lot of worth to my account, which is great, because i got a lot of things I need to build up, a lot of things I need to trade for. Oh, sparkles! Oh, another so rush. Lucky- Aw, oh, ha ha! Oh my goodness, today is my lucky day. That's three rares in a row. Let's go through this. Another so rush. That is incredibly lucky. And road rash, which surprisingly, uh, the vault version, which is, uh, Torquistador, is actually worth a lot, even outside of this raid event, so I'm very happy about that. Yeah, I could care less about this dude, but, you know, whatever. Trading fodder. So, uh, going through, got Fulmar again. Maybe I can build up a new, uh, rare of that dude. Banunus. I like to eat, 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 koopies and banunus. Alright, so, <laughs> got more commons here. Nothing that interesting. Going down. It'd be really interesting if we saw the common for gold fleece come back up again, but I don't think they're going to bring that back anytime soon. Anyway, 40 koopies. And time to do another. I'm not sure how many I have left, but, uh... I'm quite satisfied with these pulls. Ooh, sparkles! Ooh! Tight, or tighty, tighty, whatever. Yeah, I don't know how to say that. <laughs> tight? Titty? <laughs> Titty. Uh, yes, I am 12 years old. Not really, but uh, still laugh at Titty. Anyway, one rare, not that great. And, oh. I'm getting two of these uncommons, that's interesting. Usually only get one of each. No more heart cloven. I, I guess they all ran away from me. They didn't like how I was bragging that I'm a heart cloven magnet or something. Okay, so scrolling through. More commons. Do 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 and do 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 Okay, forty six of koopies. Alright, let's build again. Do we still have more? Oh, yes, we have more! Ah, oh, the goodness just keeps coming, doesn't it? Ah, another raid person! And, oh, another Manas! I'm a happy person. And, let's just get through all this. Oh, another Mud Pup. Can't complain with that. And, okay, so, got some good stuff. Uh, going through now. <laughs> mud Pup. Banunu, and lots of worthless commons. Let's just go through this. Do, do, do. I'm gonna have a lot of, uh, what are they called? Even glories? Whatever wallflower turns into after this. A koopy, a koopy, the girl that's hard to get. Okay, 42 left. Okay, so we went through a thousand so far. Got some pretty good stuff. Let's finally build that 42, shall we? And uh, I was hoping for another rare, but oh well, can't ask for everything. So just going through these. Actually, that was a lot of commons in that poll. Kind of disappointing. I was hoping for something a little better in 42, but whatever. Somehow it seems that when you pull 100, you got a much better chance of getting uncommons. I don't know if that's just a uh, coincidence or not, but whatever. Anyway, 24 koopies. And that is the end of our poll. And uh, remember, all the data will be in that little link that will be in the description. If you were too lazy and just want to skip to the end, and so on and so forth, or 
well, you already watched it, you want to see all the data put into a nice little chart and whatnot. And uh, that will actually be updated regularly, because I'm not going to be making uh, many poll videos like this, unless, of course, I do another massive poll. But for the meantime, I'm going to be pulling all the picks that I can during this event. Anyway, take care, everybody, and good luck.